In this tutorial, I will walk you through TNP's new off-site Zenforo forums. I'd like to thank the tireless work on the part of the TNP admin team for making this forum transfer happen. I was originally going to make a video about how Zenforo is different from Zetaboards, but the new forum's GUI just makes so much intuitive sense. I'm sure you'll be able to figure it out, and if you're having any trouble, just ask a mod or post in the new forum suggestions channel in Port Thel on the TNP general Discord server for help. The forum is gigantic and often overwhelming for newcomers. Despite it being fairly obvious what everything is for, this video will serve as a walkthrough nonetheless. Let's start from the top in Port Thel. Uh, the first thing that we have is the docks, okay? Uh, this is where you can apply for citizenship, um, the North Pacific Army and military sign up, um, and the executive staff ministries. Additionally, foreign envoys uh, can receive uh, masking here. Within the docks, there is an archive called the North Pacific FAQs. I found these actually pretty helpful as a newcomer myself, um, and these may be worth a read. Um, after the docks, we have the North Pacific University. Uh, the university is designed as a place where veteran players can share knowledge about miscellaneous nation-states topics with others. You can also find a whole bunch of real-life stuff here as well, uh, but that's besides the point. There are a number of subforums here, and you should take the time to explore them. My personal favorites are the Wizard of Oz Lecture Hall, where you can find um, lectures by uh, prominent NS players, um, as well as the Regional History subforum here. Um, which just sort of gives you some background about how TNP got to be the way it is today. Um, after the North Pacific University, we have the Out of Character Forum. Uh, this is built almost entirely for spam games, which you can find under this Games and Arts section here. Um, and as you can see, there are tons of them. Um, make sure you post in Count to Ten before El Fiji Grande posts in order to try to beat me at my game. I'm pretty good at this one. Um, so after that, we have the Roleplay uh, subforum. This forum is for all Eras World RP. Uh, you can post and write fact books, um, you can conduct negotiations, you can get yourself on the map in the cartography sections, and conduct NS sports. Uh, there's also a subforum dedicated to non Eras RP down here, uh, so other RPs are also acceptable here. I'm definitely not the best guy to do a walkthrough of these RP sections. So perhaps um, I'll have Prydania or Riasta make a RP specific one for a future video. All right, so to go back out, next we have Magicality City. Uh, this forum subsection is dedicated to all facets of the North Pacific's regional government and is named for an influential former delegate, Magicality. Um, the Agora is best known for its role as a forum uh, that hosts our region's democratic elections. Uh, you'll also find political parties in here, um, as well as private news media organizations such as the well-known Breitbart News, which I recommend reading, it's quite fun. Um, and we all know what it parodies. Uh, this Temple Courts down here uh, is the home of the Feek. I really hope I'm pronouncing that right. Um, this is the Temple Court of Flemingovianism, which is sort of TNP's non-official religion. Well, it might be official, uh, but I myself will likely never accept it. Um, also, uh, within the Agora at the bottom, um, you can find a couple of neat topics. Uh, such as regional events like a message in a bottle campaign and the annual delegate delirium a Message in a bottle was an event in which users anonymously exchanged kind remarks with each other And I thought it was really neat and I really hope that we get to do it another time soon Perhaps for uh, the holidays at the end of this year uh, Delegate delirium is an annual competition and regional poll to award uh, popular delegates um, I believe Silly String was the winner of the last one in 2018. Democracy Day and then other events with, you know, the Constabula Code um, and, you know, Flag Day and whatnot can also be found here. 
So to go all the way back out, the regional assembly here, the RA, is TNP's regional legislature. Um, all citizens are member of the of the regional assembly, uh, and you can propose, discuss, and vote on bills here. Bills are typically introduced and discussed in the forum um, down below here in the form of simple topics. Um, though private halls also exist for regional security related topics, and I'm not going to enter that for that reason. Um, the residence lobby uh, is is there for citizens who. Rather, sorry, it's there for residents, not citizens, uh, who choose not to join in the RA, uh, but still want to voice their concerns um, and provide their two cents on the proceedings, the goings on within the regional assembly. Um, and then as, as you may have already guessed, the voting floor is used for voting on the aforementioned bills. So uh, next down in Magicality City, we have the Delegates Government, which is the executive branch of the North Pacific. Here you will find subforums for each government ministry, including defense. Um, in the topics down below, you can find the thread for oaths of office, uh, officer appointments, and delegate question time, which is a Q&A and discussion thread for the delegate. Um, all right, and then Security Council. I'm, I'm gonna go into more detail on each of the ministries in a subsequent video, so I sort of skipped over that for now. Uh, the Security Council is the forum used for all matters relating to the SC, obviously. Uh, here you can find the SC application thread, uh, the Vice Delegates Desk, and um, Council Chambers, which are used for official business of the Security Council. Then we have the Court of the North Pacific, which hosts the judicial branch of TNP. Topics include uh, court rules and procedures, um, as well as uh, requests for review. Um, the Office of the Attorney General includes uh, term summaries, uh, deputy AG appointments, um, and the docket, the complaint docket up here. Um, you should note that the courtroom is strictly reserved for uh, court filings and should be treated as such. And then the public gallery here is used primarily by the Court Bulletin Board, um, which hosts archives of the North Pacific's legal documents, uh, past cases, um, and judicial review. Um, and you know, this is actually quite nice for newcomers to read through. So. I'll leave that behind. The next section, um, way back out, is Embassy Row, all right? Um, we can find forums for each region we currently share forum embassies with, um, and regional updates will be posted in here. And then at the very bottom of the forum, uh, there are individual topics for embassy requests, and if you're a new nation uh, to the North Pacific, this is something you don't need to worry about. Uh, pretty much at all. This is this is something that foreign affairs will handle. Um, so then we have Tressville here. I'm still not sure how this is pronounced. Um, when I asked Aluvatar, he eluded the question. Um, perhaps that's just in his nature. Um, here we're going to find the World Assembly Legislative League. Um, this is also referred to as WAL. Um, and this is a WA voting block made up of influential regions from around the NS world. This will be discussed in more depth later when we get to the WA Affairs Ministry and perhaps next video as well when I discuss what the World Assembly is in the first place because we still haven't gotten to that. Uh, the World Assembly Protocols Forum, no, Proposals Forum, and that's Protocols, um, this is where you can discuss drafts for uh, various different proposals in the hopes that by editing and drafting it you can actually increase uh, the chance that that vote when it goes to the WA will be successful. The WA um, wall reference library here is full of a ton of serious topics uh, but also inside jokes from formal de former delegate Ren, um, Renaissance -er, as you can see. Um, importantly, in these topics discussed down below in the wall uh, section, we have the wall discord link, 
um, which we'll cover in another video again, um, as well as Mouse Bumple's WA 101 lecture series. And seriously, you should read this if you want to uh, get a good introduction to the WA and to get really involved in World Assembly Affairs. It's really, it's a bit outdated at this point because it was published back in 2014 and 2015, but it's the best I have seen uh, ever in my career on nation states. So, highly recommend that. Uh, then, beneath Tressville, we have this temporary forum, Ears on Head. Uh, I suspect that this won't be around for very much longer because it's really just a, a testing forum used during the Zenforo forum transfer from Zetaports to make sure that everything is functioning as, uh, as it should. It is still used as a way to suggest uh, forum improvements, add-ons, and changes, but again, uh, Hurstleton in forum operations is typically used for that. So looking in here, um, Hurstleton hosts the admin operations, which include a moderator discussion subforum and a few useful topics. Um, so admin requests is used by government officials to implement masking changes and other official business. Um, McMasterdonia also posted this guide to Zenforo. Uh, it's not as helpful as I would have hoped personally, but it does detail a few of the changes between uh, Zenforo and Zeta boards, which I would have gone over in this video in a bit more detail. Still, this is a good place to look if you're having trouble. Um, and then lastly, we have the admin appreciation thread. Um, if you have any kind words for the admin uh, team, then I'm sure they'll appreciate that if you, if you leave them a kind message. So at the very, very bottom of the forum, we have the general regional archives. And this is, there's just so much to be found in here. I simply don't have the time to discuss everything that's in here. I do know that the mound has uh, past election history and whatnot, um, but this is there's a lot to go on. There's a lot to explore. I encourage you to take a look around and do some digging because you never know what you might find and it will probably be very interesting. Anyway, so that's that. Uh, these are the North Pacific's offsite forums. It's a lot to take in, I know. Once you start posting with some frequency, you'll get to know it pretty well. Compared to other regional offsite forums I've seen, it's actually fairly well organized. Um, another thing that you should probably note is if you go over to uh, laws over here, um, you can find sort of like the legal code of the North Pacific, uh, including our constitution, bill of rights, legal code, uh, court rulings, and you know, a lot of our bilateral treaties, and you can read more about the World Assembly Legislative League wall here as well. Um, so this is quite nice. And then one other thing that I would like to note is that uh, I mentioned in an earlier video that um, you can endorse other members within the North Pacific and that doing so is encouraged. So it can be sometimes difficult to find other WA members or to find all of them because there's well over a thousand WA members currently within the North Pacific. So if you go over to this tab, which says endorse, uh, this is a custom tool that was built. You can put in your nation name here. Uh, oh gosh, that's just, uh, so if I put in my name, El Fiji Grande, and I hit submit, I will see all of the nations that I have not currently endorsed on this side. And because you can't endorse yourself, you're always going to find yourself here. Um, you're also going to find any WA nations that aren't endorsing you as of yet. So you could theoretically run a telegram campaign to try to get them to endorse you back, um, which can be difficult, but you also have to, to watch out. There isn't an official endorsement cap, but you shouldn't uh, get so high that you're uh, at risk of overtaking any of the Security Council members, especially the Vice Delegate. Um, and then if you click these links, this will open up Nation States again for you. And if I was logged in to my nation, um, like so, I could scroll down to the bottom and presumably uh, endorse these members. So that's what that tool is for. Um, quite useful and I do recommend it. Um, 
So as I was saying, uh, compared to other forums that I've seen, this this is actually fairly well put together. Um, after watching this walkthrough tutorial, again, I know it's a lot to take in. If you still need help, you can get a forum mentor. Forum mentors are typically automatically assigned, but if you haven't already received a private message from one, uh, simply PM, DM, Telegram, or ping the Minister of Home Affairs about getting one. Um, they'll help you get more acquainted with the boards and answer any questions you might have. Oh, and speaking of private messages and whatnot, you can find those in your inbox over here. Uh, although I currently don't have any conversations running, so you don't see any. Um, hopefully this was helpful. Uh, that's all for this tutorial. In the next tutorials, I will uh, return to Nation States itself to discuss the World Assembly and Wall, um, as well as some other features on NS. Um, you're listening to NBS. Uh, this is your compass for navigating the region and the wider NS world. Thanks for listening.